discussions with the uh, Chamber of Commerce, and I'll have further discussions with Peter Townsend this afternoon. We'll also be talking to the CEO, some of who have some businesses affected. But what is different this time to last time is that there's quite a, a big cordon at the moment, um, and the question is how long that cordon uh, will be in place where, where activity can't occur. Now, last time we managed to get that cordon reduced rapidly. This time it's likely to take a considerable period of time. We don't know exactly, um, but you can imagine there are many businesses located in that area. So my sense of the economic support that the government will need to provide is that it will need to be broader and of a slightly different nature to last time. It may incorporate some similar characteristics to last time, but I don't think on its own that would be sufficient for the length of time that some businesses will be operating outside of the CBD. Um, again, we're taking some advice from Treasury and others. It's important that we get that right. Um, but again, my guess is in the early part of next week, if I was in a position to do that at post cap on Monday, that would be great, but I can't guarantee that.